Hello, it's Stu here from DIYmusic.co.uk with another FL Studio tutorial. Last time we looked at linking a MIDI controller to any parameter in FL Studio. In this video, I'll show you how to record automation from that external MIDI controller. I've got a little pattern set up here. So you may recognize the uh, very simple beat from the last video. What I've done now is just record a clean guitar going into the, that, so that sounds like this. Very simple guitar playing there for me. I've run that through a channel with Amplitude on it, which is an amazing guitar simulation uh, amp simulator. So if I turn that on, you'll hear it sounds a bit more meaty. <laughs> Okay, that's great, but what I want to do is use this wah pedal, but control it with my foot pedal externally. So, uh, the way Amplitude works, I can't right click and link to a controller straight away. I have to, first of all, assign the automation to a parameter within Amplitude. So I'll pick parameter number one, and then I'll go to Browse Parameters up here same as the last video, parameter one, right click and link to controller. It's on auto detect so I'll just touch my pedal and there we go, I'm now controlling that pedal with my foot so I can play around with that. How cool is that? So it's just like having a real guitar pedal, I could use this live but I want to record so I'm going to attempt to record that automation into FL Studio. So first of all, uh, right click on the record button and make sure automation is ticked. That'll make sure that it records any automation that's going in. Then we'll find a new pattern to record it into. Call it Wah Controller. Let's spell it properly. Or not. Okay, so I've got a, a new pattern selected, automation check there, click record. Now, when I press play, I should get a count in and then I should be able to record that automation. Let's try. Awesome. Okay, I'll get out of the way for a second. Now you can see that pattern has gone straight to the playlist. And uh, it should be automatically controlling. Come on. Here we go. The wire. Turn off record. <laughs> And that's it, we've recorded the automation, but there is one more little thing that I just want to point out. So if I open this automation, I just double clicked on the uh, track. It's very steppy, it's not a very smooth curve. So just to make it that little bit nicer, choose Interpolate tool from here and just drag it across the whole uh, recorded automation, let go. What that's done is just smooth out the curves a bit. We'll play that, see how it sounds. And with and with that I maxed out my CPU, but that's just because I've been pushing FL a bit too hard today and Amplitude is, is quite a CPU hungry uh, plug-in but you get the idea apart from that uh, that's how you uh, record automation so thank you very much again I've been Stu from DIYmusic.co.uk um, 
stick around, follow my uh, Facebook page and Twitter and YouTube account for more tutorials and blog posts and articles and stuff like that. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye.